In this video, I'm going to show you how to get back your old version of CapCard on your PC without downloading or reinstalling CapCard. So if you're using CapCard, you will know that CapCard is forcing you to update your version of the CapCard PC that you're using. So whenever you try to export a video, it gives you watermark and or else it will, or else it will tell you to join the core version. But you don't want that. You don't want any update. You just want to edit your video with the old version. So to get that, just click on the CapCut, right click on it. If you're on Windows 10, you will have a properties option. If you're on Windows 11, you have to select this show more option here. And after that, click on this open file location. Then here you'll find the CapCut exe file. And up there, you will find all the updated version of your CapCut. So I have already installed CapCut for a long time and I didn't update it. So I only have the 3.8 version. But if you frequently updated your CapCut PC, you will have a lot of version here. I'll tell you to install the 4.3 or 4.4 version, which was not the pro version. So if, if I just go back to this folder, 3.8. And here, you just need to find the CapCut exe file. So here is the CapCut exe file. So if I just click on this, it will directly open the older version of the CapCut PC. As you can see, this is open the old. Now if I go to the settings here, as you can see, this is the version of 3.8, which is the older version of the CapCut. Now I can export any video, use any kind of effects and transition in the video without joining the Pro option here. But remember, you cannot edit any new project that you have already used in the newer version. So you have to use the older version and you can only create new videos with the older version. Also, I can get back to my older project in CapCut, the old version that I use. So just right click on it, go to show more option and just create a shortcut. And let me just minimize that and just pin the older version of the CapCut shortcut in my desktop. Now you can export any video without any watermark and using the old version. You can also use the pro ver version of older effects that you use are now pro. So that's it guys. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe and thank you for watching.